If you're interested in learning how to play Japanese Mahjong, also known as Reach, you might be interested in this video. I'm going to play Solitaire. This is not the Solitaire that you might be thinking of, where you pick off pairs. This is the four-player game. I'm going to play four hands at one time. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to improve your game, consider subscribing to my channel and click the bell when you do so you get notification for when I post new videos. Let's play some solitaire. I have all my tiles out and I have them lined up in walls. I'll be dealing the tiles to east, 14 tiles, then 13 for south, west, and north. Let's check out Dora. Six crack is Dora. Okay, let's see what we can do with East. No honors at all. Let's see what kind of blocks we can make here. Here we have a two, three, four, that's a chi, three in a sequence. We have a five, six, or we could use the four there. So there's some wiggle room there. We have a seven, a six, eight, where we need a seven. That's called a inside weight or a closed weight. Then this is isolated. We have an edge weight with a eight, nine. Here's a pair, gotta have a pair. Oops, let's put that forward and these back. Those are isolated. So we have one, two, three, four, five. You wanna have five blocks that are strong. This is complete. This is a side weight, so that is strong. This is a closed weight, which is not very strong. That is weak. And this is an edge weight, which is also weak. But I think I would still play for Pinfu, and we have two Dora tiles. The next number up in line from the Dora indicator is special. If you can win, you'll get score for that. So let's try for Pinfu, and we'll start by discarding. It doesn't matter, these three have to go because we've already got our blocks. Let's see what we can do for South. They have a pair of white dragon and they have two pair here, eight and sevens. Oh, that goes like that. Okay, so let's see here. We have an eight, nine. Here's an eight, nine and here's an eight, nine. Maybe we could play mixed triple chi, mixed triple chi, seven, eight, nine in each suit. So let's look and see what that's called for reach terminology. Reach terminology for mixed triple chi is sanshoku, sanshoku, something like that, sanshoku. Okay, so I think that's a good plan here. So I think we'll uh, see how things go, but I think I would go ahead and discard maybe the five dot. We'll see. Let's keep going. All right, no Dora for the six crack, but we have two red fives. That's called Aka Dora, Aka Dora, and you get score for that if you win. So I think we should try to build around the Dora, the Aka Dora. And we even have one, two, three, four, five blocks. We can just discard all these. As pretty as they are, we're gonna discard those. We'll try for Akadora. This is gonna be a bit of a challenge because here we have a uh, side weight, but all these are closed weights where we need one specific tile to complete them. Let's see what happens and look at what North has.
They have Dora. We need to try to work that in. And they have a T potential here. There's a side weight. There's a closed weight where we need a five dot, need a two dot or a five dot. There's a T right there and a one bam. Now for Pinfu, which is all cheese, you can have a valueless pair. And since West is not their seat, this is North, we can use that pair for Pinfu. So I think I would start by discarding that North. So let's go. We'll discard a one dot for East and draw for South. Whoops. Let's draw for South. Eight to crack. That's a good tile. If we're going to play mixed triple chi, we have a seven, eight, nine. Here's a seven, eight. That's isolated. This is isolated, but here we have an eight, nine and an eight, nine. So one, two, three, four, five. Let's discard the three crack. Maybe we could get a red five dot up here for a pair. Who knows? Let's draw for south or west. We're going to draw for west. Six bam. That's a good tile because now we have a side weight, five six, where we need either a four or a seven. I suppose we could do that and that. Three, five, six, seven. Let's go ahead and discard the north and draw for north. Five bam, and look at, that's Akadora. We gotta try to build that in for sure. Let's get rid of the north. Okay, we're gonna draw four east. Two bam. Okay, now two bam. That's a potential chi with a closed weight. So we already have the one, two, three, four, and a pair. We've already got our blocks. Let's go ahead and just throw this though. Seven bam. This is a um, side weight, closed weight, edge weight, closed weight. We'll have to wait and see. Too bad our pair isn't in a simple tile. We could play all simples, which aren't ones and nines are called terminals. Simples are two through eight. So we could get some extra score. We'll see what happens. Let's go ahead and draw for south. They got a south. So we're trying to get them to mix triple chi. Mix triple chi. Let's discard the south. And draw for west. Four crack. That's a good tile for them. Four, five, two, three, six, seven, nine, three, five. Okay, they've got a lot of blocks here. Let's go ahead and get rid of the green and see if we can tighten things up there. We might be able to just do five, six, seven and throw these. We'll see. Let's get rid of those first and draw four north. Red Dragon, they're playing Pinfu and this can bring value, so we need to discard that. Red Dragon. Nobody can take that, so we'll draw for east. They drew an east. We're trying for Pinfu here, so we're going to discard east. Can't have value, and that's their seat. And it's the wind of the round. Let's draw for south. Seven bam. That's perfect. Seven eight nine. Seven eight nine. We need a seven dot here. That could be our pair. Let's discard. Seven, eight, nine. We need a seven dot there. Seven dot for mixed triple chi. Let's discard the five band or five dot. Okay, let's draw for west. Two dot. Red dragon. And we'll draw for north. One dot. There's their pair. We need to try to work this six in. There's a potential chi here for six. 
three, four, or one, two. Either way, we need a two or a five. One, five, six, seven. This, hmm. Let's discard the one dot. Okay, everybody has discarded three tiles now. He's ready to declare reach. Let's draw four east to crack. So we have a pair, eight, nine, six, eight, six is Dora. So we wanna build around those or incorporate them. It looks like we have too many pair here. Maybe we could get a one crack here because here's a four, five, six. Or maybe we could use the one. Here's an eight, nine, six, eight, five, six, two, three, four, or three, four. There's some work to be done in there, but here's a pair. We could do one, two, three. Edge weight, closed weight, side weight, closed weight, edge weight. Let's discard the four band. And let's draw four south. Eight dot, oh, they got a pair. Look at that, they have a pair. So they have seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine. Here's a pair, oh, we have a pair there too. They don't need a pair. They don't need two pair. Let's see here. Seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine. If we get a seven, eight, nine, that's also called a pure double chi, two different chi's. So, If we discard the white dragon and use this as a pair, we could also declare reach with Pinfu because Pinfu is all cheese and a valueless pair. Let's discard the white dragon. We've already got a pair right here. So let's draw now for West. Three bam. Okay, white dragon was thrown. Let's discard it. Oops, I put that in the wrong place. Okay, here we go. Now, we're gonna draw four north, seven dot. So we have a pair west. Here's a six, seven, three, four, five, six, seven. We need to try to incorporate this six crack. Let's discard the one crack and draw four east. Four crack. Oh, that's nice. Four, five, six. So there's an eight, nine, six, eight, four, five, six, two, three, four, one, two. We even have a pair right there. Let's get rid of the one bam. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So we have too much going on here. One, two, three, four, five. This is an ed, uh, side weight. This is a closed weight and an edge weight. We'll have to see how that comes. Okay, here we go. South, two band. We can discard that. Well, let's get rid of the white dragon. And let's draw for west. They got an east. We need to discard that because that could bring value. East is the wind of the round. Let's draw for north. Nine crack, that's too far away from the six. Let's go ahead and discard the one bam. And let's draw four east, south, discard. So six discards, they didn't make it. We'll keep going for them though. Let's draw for south, nine dot. We need a seven dot or a nine crack. Let's hold the nine dot and just discard the two bam and draw four west. Five crack. 
Okay, maybe that could be their pair. There's a pair here too. Pair, chi, potential chi, potential chi, pair, potential chi. Let's throw the two dot. One, two, three, four, five, six. Too many blocks. Maybe. Okay, let's keep going. We'll draw for north. Eight bam, that's a good tile. Here we have, let's see, pair of west, six, seven, three, four, because they've already got their pair, six, seven, eight, or five, six, seven, five, six, seven, leveraging that Dora there. And then here's another Dora with that six. Let's see here. How many pair do we have? One, two, three. I don't think that's enough to try for seven pair, which is also called Chitoitsu. I think we should go ahead and discard the nine crack. Okay, let's draw four east. Two dot, discard. Let's draw four south. Four bam, discard. Drawing four west. Five bam, that might help. Pair, chi. This could be either five, six, seven, or seven, eight, nine. Here's a potential chi. There's a pair, another chi. This is Akador though. We need to try to use that. Let's go ahead and discard the three bam. That way we can try to use these Akadora tiles. Let's draw four north. Two bam, two bam. That's a discard. Let's draw four east. Eight bam, that would be a discard. Let's draw four south. Three dot, we can discard that. And draw four west. Green dragon, we want to get rid of that. That could bring value as a pair. You can't have a pwn in a hand that's all cheese. We're going to move to north. 6 p.m. That's a good tile. Okay, so we have a 5, 6, 5, 6, 7, or 7, 8. We've got even a pure double chi potential here. Let's discard the 4 dot. And let's draw 4 east. 4 crack. Four crack. Let's put them in order here. Maybe a pattern will emerge. Look at all those cracks. We have a pair of twos. You got to have a pair. Here's a three, four. Here's a two, three, four. Ooh, pure double chi. Four, five, six, four, six. If we get a five crack. So we would have. We need a pair in here though. Pair. One, two, three, four, five. Let's get rid of the one bam. And we'll get rid of the two bam next and focus on these. Maybe we could even switch to um Chinese. Is it what's it called? All one suit. Chinitsu. Chinitsu is all one suit. Let's draw four south white. That's already been thrown several times. Let's draw four west. One crack. Pair. One, two, three, or two, three, four. That really didn't help too much. Let's discard. Either way, we would need a four in here, so we really don't need this three bam. They already threw that away too. Okay, let's draw four north. Seven, 
Oh, they got a tile to use with their Dora. Okay, now we have to make a choice. So there's a pair, six, seven. That's a good block because it's a side weight. Three, four is a side weight. Seven, eight is a side weight. Five, six, five, six. Okay, we have way too many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We need four T's and a pair. We got a pair, so something's gotta go. Here's a six, seven, eight. We can do a five, six here, and we can leverage Dora here. One, two, three, four, still too many. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe we could do five, six, seven, five, six, seven for another pure double chi. The same sequence here. Let's get rid of the eight bam. And then let's see if we can maybe get a five crack and a five dot. Then we could have a, a mixed triple chi, which is called san shoku. Okay, let's draw for east. Two crack, two, three, four, two bam. That's what we were gonna throw next. Two bam, pair, chi, potential, pure double chi. So we have that four, five, six, and a four, six. We could maybe throw the eight crack next. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's draw for south. Nine crack. Oh, they did it. Seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. Eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. Here's their pair. So they're ready on a seven dot. We will reach with a nine dot for south. Okay, so that took them six, seven, eight, nine, ten discards to get to reach. They're ready on a seven dot. Their Yaku would be pure double chi, mixed triple chi. Yeah, two. They don't get pinfu because we're, we have an edge weight. You need a a side weight for pinfu. So we have pure double chi and mixed triple chi. So that's two yaku and that's one han each. No dora. But that's still exciting. So we have reach, mixed triple chi, and pure double chi. Three han. Okay, so let's draw now for west. Now, let me stop a minute because a lot of times I, I tend to play to win but I really should consider folding when somebody reaches. From what I've read in Dana Chiba's strategy book, which there's a link below the video to that, you need to assess your position against the players who reach or declare ready. So you need to either be uh, one away from winning, you have a good weight, and a high value hand. If you are more than one away, you have a low value hand and a bad weight, you should fold. So let's look at what everybody has. We have one away from, one away from, let's see, pure double chi and pinfu. And they have two Dora. So that's four Han. Dora is one each. Pure double chi is one and pinfu is one. So that's four. They're one away. Now Mangan or um, four, five Han or greater is considered, well, Mangan I guess is considered medium. Hanuman, which is six Han or more, is considered high value. So they have... They're ready and they have a good weight. So I'd say we push to win for East. For West, West has a potential pure double chi. They have 
two discards. They're still two away. Um, they do have a good weight and their hand is low value. They only have, let's see, for them it would be potentially Pinfu, Pure Double Chi, and Akador, which is three Han. So I would say they probably should fold. Oh wait, they have two Akadora. They're kind of in the same situation as East. I would say let's push for them. Now for North, they have also a Pure Double Chi, but they have two discards and they also have one, two, three, four side weights. I think everybody should push. Okay, well, let's see what happens. <laughs> Not everybody can win. So let's draw for West. One crack. They have a pair, including Dora. Okay, so let's see. So, okay, we just need to pick a discard now. So, we want to try to use this Akadora. L let's discard the 9 Bam. Either the 9 Bam or the 1 Crack. Let's discard 9 Bam. And let's draw 4 North, South. South, there are two out. Let's throw it. And let's draw for East. West. How many eight cracks? Are, no eight cracks are out. Let's discard the West. And draw for South. 9 BM. That was thrown and nobody wanted it. So we'll discard that. Let's draw for West. Nine dot. Nine dot was discarded by South. Let's draw for North. Red Dragon, that's been thrown three times now. Let's draw for East. North. North has been thrown twice. We'll discard that. Let's draw four south. West. North has good discards. Let's draw four west. Five dot. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Pair fives. Two, three, four. I suppose they could do a one, two, three, and a four, five, six if they get a six crack. Five, six. Let's discard the one crack. We have way too many pairs. Okay, let's draw four north. Four bam. Okay, that's good for them. Now we have four, five, six. Five six seven three four six seven six seven. This is Dora. Let's discard the West. That's been discarded even by South. Let's draw four East. Six crack. Oh, six crack. Another Dora. Oh, oh, wait. Yep, wait. We can. We can. They didn't reach, so we can change things up for them. So here's a pair of twos, two, three, four, four, five, six, four, five, six, six, seven, eight, maybe. We need a five crack and a seven crack. Let's discard the nine dot. And let's draw four south. I might even declare cheese from north if they discard. So let's draw four south. One dot, discard. Drawing four west. Six dot. They got a good tile right there. Okay, pair. Chi, potential chi, potential chi, chi. One, two, three, four, five. Five dot. Five dot is in south's discard pile. 
and then we can discard this four crack. They might even be able to reach. Let's draw four north, seven dot. We can get rid of this west. Maybe that could even be their pair. We could maybe get rid of the six there. Let's draw four east, south. We can discard that safely and draw four south. Three bam, discard. Drawing four west, four bam, that's a keeper. Let's discard the four crack and reach. We have a pair, a chi. There's a chi, but, oh, here we go. You need to make it so that you're on a waiting on a two-sided two weight like this. If we used the six here for the four, five, six, this would have been, would have been a closed weight. So just by moving things around, you can better your position. So we're going to discard the four crack and reach four west. One, two, three, four, five. They need a three bam or a six bam to win. Three bam or six bam. Now three bam is in their discard pile. They can only win with a six bam. They can only win with a six bam because there's a three bam in their discard pile. That is called Furitan. So they are Furitan. They can only win by drawing a three bam and they can claim a discard for a six bam. So let's draw four north. Red dragon, that's a good discard. And let's draw four east, six dot. Six dot and eight dot. None of those are out but they are getting ready on a uh, Chinitsu. Chinitsu, they're two away from Chinitsu, which is a five Han hand. That's Mangan. I'm gonna push. Let's discard a six dot and draw four east. Four dot. Oh, we're drawing for south, sorry. This is east, this is south, this is west, and that is north. Let's draw four west, one dot. That is a good discard. And we're gonna draw four north, two dot. Okay, seven, two, three, four, six. They're ready to win on Pinfu, and they actually got there in time. So let's reach. I'm still learning when to reach and when not to, but they're ready on, they have Dora, Akadora, Pinfu, and Pure Double Chi. That's four Han. If they get Urjor, they could be up to Mongon. So they're ready on a five crack or a six crack. So let's draw four east, seven dot. Let's discard an eight dot and draw four, ooh, draw four south, two dot. That's a discard. Let's draw four west, three bam. Three bam, they did it. They drew into their hand right here. They got lucky. Sumo, sumo. So they actually get the sticks for south and north. Pinfu, two Akadora, So that's three. Let's look at Uradora. Three dot. No, they barely got it. So that's only three Han. But they did get these sticks, 1,000 each. 
I hope that gives you an idea of what it's like to play Japanese style mahjong. It is very complex and a lot of fun to play. If you are into card games and you like strategy games, analytical games, this is a great game for you. Look at the links below the video for more information on how to play this great game. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, consider subscribing and click the bell when you do so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss any opportunities to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an insight of the game that might give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Japanese Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.